Some say that he eats tyres and drinks petrol. Others that he sleeps in the boot of a Nissan Leaf with his fingers in a 12 volt socket. All we know is he's called the Sprig. Sprig, we're here today at Evolution 2014, Scotland's new motoring show. You must be really beside yourself. I'll take that, I think, as a yes. Now, what are you looking forward to drive? We've got BMW, we've got Tesla, we've got fabulous cars here from Peugeot, the 208 GTI. What's your heart set on? It's not very often that I get the opportunity to see so many cars from so high up. And here we've got fabulous cars come from all over the country to be here today for the entertainment and enjoyment of regular drivers, regular people who every day get in their cars and use them for their work, for their home life. And today they can come and see what's new, what's happening and have a great day out. Today we've got electric bikes, we've got vans, we've got cars and probably most impressively, the first sighting of the BMW i8 in the UK. There are only two in existence and we have one of them right here, right now. We're gonna grab a chat with the gentleman who's just come back in the i3. I wanna know, what does he think of it? Is it really as good as the press say? What do real drivers think of this car? Let's go find out. Absolutely, it's a brilliant wee car actually. First electric car I've ever driven. Brilliant car. When you think about performance cars, you think about Ferrari, you think about Porsche, you think about Lamborghini. I've driven all of those cars, but I'm actually more excited than ever to be in something new, revolutionary, and frankly, quite remarkable. You're sitting today in a Tesla Model S. Probably things have moved on a bit more than I expected. I thought we'd be right at the starting point here, but obviously uh, we're a bit further down the track. Sir, hello, welcome back. Okay. How does it feel to be here, having driven the i3? Well, I can tell you, in all honesty, my blood pressure has dropped by about 50%. <laughs> it's been fantastic. Have you driven an electric car before? Uh, no, no, I haven't actually. And Not at all. Uh, my perception, being of a certain age, is that they resemble milk floats. Electric cars are a bit like very old, slow, unpleasing to drive sort of vehicles. Mm. What's your impression having driven one for the first time? Well, I know a little bit about the BMW i3 and uh, it's far from that. That car is a skyrocket as far as electric cars are concerned. 172 brake horsepower that's available to you right from zero. So it's an absolute revelation. This is fantastic. This is so much bigger than I thought it would be. And uh, I've only been here for about five minutes, but I already want to buy about four of the cars. <laughs> so uh, yeah, absolutely loving it. Whoa! <laughs> I'll be honest, I've always been skeptical about electric cars. People thinking it's never going to take off because one, they don't have the, the power and the, the range. But with this car, I mean, I have to say you're, you're there. You go electric, you know, you're, you're helping the environment, plus you're saving money for the company as well. Yeah, brilliant, brilliant message. Thank you ever so much. Thanks for taking the time. Lovely to meet you.